I'm pulling in here. We're gonna set up right over here by this gate here. I'm gonna get this bowl loaded out. Man, it's slimy. All right, gotta go. Well, we're uh, waiting on this bowl here. I haven't seen him yet, but I guess he's pretty slow hurting. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another wonderful hoof trimming video. Here you can see the very lame but very large Angus bull that we're going to put into our trimming chute to see what is wrong with his foot. From this angle, it's hard to really see if he has any leg damage, but once we get him up on the chute, I'll let you guys make the decision whether or not his leg might be bothering him as well. So we got him latched up here. His leg is quite swollen and hard. Like you can see, this has a pressure relief on it, so it can't really squeeze him any harder than that, and he's obviously not struggling from it. But a normal dairy cow, this will completely close. So even on these bigger front feet, you can see it's getting closer. He's a very thick, big bull, but man, that leg is swollen. And as for this hoof, it doesn't look great either. So now we're going to just clean it up a little bit to see if we can pinpoint if there's any major problems on this bull's hoof. What I have found in the front of this foot is just a little bit of a digital dermatitis lesion. Nothing very major, not even very large, but enough to bother him. Now let's remove some of this extra thick horn on the sole. As you can tell, the sole is twisted or the way this toe is shaped is twisted which tells me that there is some damage internally within this toe. So here, let's clean this toe up and see what we can find. Oopsie. So now we'll use our hoof tight winter glue and put a block on this bowl because we obviously want to relieve the weight off of each toe. Now we're going to Here you will see where we're looking at the white line where obviously there is some separation and where something appears to be trying to come out. This reassures me now that there is something inside this hoof, some sort of infection. That just squirted me right square in my friggin' pants. There it is. That's what we wanted. Oh yeah. That's nasty. Ugh. Kind of like seafood that kind of sat in the sun and got regurgitated by an ostrich. So guys, now what we're doing is we're just simply putting a wrap over the lesion and putting some copper sulfate on the digital dermatitis to hopefully heal that. But the vet will now have to get involved due to the swelling, due to the infection. I'm glad I was able to relieve pressure on this bull's hoof and hopefully he's able to feel better. But the vet at this point will need to get involved for further action.
How are you, Master Bull? Yeah, that leg hurts.